Today we have this pair of $900 Gucci horse bit loafers. Are they really worth the price point of $900? Well today we're going to cut these apart, we're going to get them resold, refurbished, and we will let you know are they worth the price. Let's get to it. As I get older, my hair turns more gray. There's a lot of things I don't like in life, but there's one thing that just blows my hair back, and that's when y'all give me a good thumbs up. Give me a thumbs up. All right, so, so far we've got a leather outsole and a thin leather, it's a thin two-piece leather hill stack.
All right, so this guy's liners, that's supposed to be a one piece. They literally just disintegrated, so we're gonna make some new ones. Finished up these new insoles. Before we go stamp them, I'm gonna let you know, we are actually in our sandal room. That's where all our stitching machines are. And we've got a lot of cool stuff coming down the pike, especially for the spring, new websites, new colors, new styles. It's gonna be a lot. All right, so we are finished. We're gonna get these things shine up though, but just remember, I'm gonna give my opinion over these horse bit Gucci loafers at the end of the video. We have wrapped up this pair of horse bit Gucci loafers. Before I tell you about those, check out potterandsons.com. We are gonna be running a big sale on all of our shoe care products this week only. So check that out as well. Now, the horse bit loafers. These are iconic. Everybody knows them. Most people love them. And the only thing that I really didn't like about them, especially for the price point at $900 was the insole. It's made out of like a, a paper board. And when you compare that to like a Carmina, which is kind of in that same realm, um, it's all leather, it's incredible products. But the leather on these Gucci's is so supple. The leather outsoles, the, the hill stacks, they're so low profile, they mold to your foot. They're very, very, very comfortable. So I like them, but for the price point, I don't know. All right, so I hope you liked the video and until next time, y'all have a good one.